Hey GTI fans, welcome back to another episode of Imperial Galactic Survival. This is Zelot here and we are currently doing Alpha 7 experimental. Um, I just whipped up a whole batch of goodies. You can see in my inventory I have a whole bunch of SV parts, so we're going to build an SV today. Uh, and I was able to go around and smash just a ton of rocks. Um, and I'm going to show you. So remember last time we stripped down a uh, civilian POI? Well, was, there was that farm too. I went over to the farm and booyah! So you can see I have a whole bunch of grow plots. I actually looted 144 steel plots. 144. So I probably won't need to ever make any. Um, I still got 90 some odd down in the in a cargo container downstairs. So, and I planted all my sprouts. Um, been germinating them. It looks like they are all ready to pick again. So let's um, let's go around and pick all these and get XP for it. So you can see we're getting massive XP. And I need to make some more texture protein. Okay, so let's just run. Oh, miss one. Come on. And a couple more on this side. Really? Is that it? Did I get that guy? Is he done? Yep, okay. And we'll, oh, that looks like it was going in my, yes, because I am full of SV parts. Derp a derp. So I have a fridge somewhere that has all that stuff in it. So let's just pile this in. And that'll go in the constructor. We'll throw that in there. Okay. So we want those in there. Okay. Okay, and we'll just pick these really quick. Oh! Base attack drones. They're just constant all the time. But my cannon just takes them out. So it's really a a moot point. So we'll be fine. I'm not going to go after the parts. That's just going to be interruptive. So what I am going to do here though is turn all of these durians, tomatoes, and pumpkins into sprouts. So that's one, two, three, one, two, three, and one, two, three. Okay. So, while they cook up, let's go, or you know what, they're probably going to cook up pretty quick and I should just plant those, right? Right? Let's take a look. Eh. The first layer of them done, the pumpkins here. Good, good. So this will finish off the pumpkins. So they're in the center plots. Excellent. And then, oh, I got to make um, protein out of, so which one was it? It's not that fridge, it's the bottom one. So I got to name those. But in the meantime, I'm just going to make a seedling, or sprout, I should say. And we'll plant these. Okay. 
Okay, so there's the tomatoes up. We're just waiting for the durians. And then once the durians are up, then the garden is done pretty much. Plant the last texture plant protein and then we just pick it constantly. We will never be hungry again. Woo! Not that I have been recently since I got some big guns to go hunt stuff, but meh. Won't have to hunt so much. Okay, come on. Last six. Are they done? Yes. Oops. Grab some back here. And we'll just grab these here. So we're going to put that in. So let's just. We should be able to do the standard. Just hold down, drag, and drop. There we go. And the texture tr plant protein. Right there, that gives us one spud left. We'll just throw that back in it. Okay, so we're completely planted. That gives us a little bit of, of everything. That'll give us nine cans of uh, vegetables. Um, yeah. So I'm going to have to move the HV. So let's put this away. <coughs> in the fridge. That was the bottom one there. Okay. Got some coffee going now, so you can it actually increases your body temperature by five, so really nice when you're starting to get really cold and freezing. Okay, let's get this out of the way. Myself jumping. <laughs> Fine. I can just go heal myself here. I've got all the necessary things right here to cure every ailment. So that's good. only cure for annoying plant dudes is by killing them though. <sighs> Don't know if I want to. Yes, there's the looted um, generator and tanks. So I'm just waiting for enough sathium so I can put down my furnace. So I just moved every. I got rid of the small generator put up more uh, cargo obviously so I got all my generators in that back room there help reduce the noise but it doesn't really it cuts through the wall like it doesn't exist I don't know I don't know anyway uh, well, let's check the water oh, that's O2 let's fill that up that's always going to be needed now forever and ever and ever. How's these guys doing? Nice. Okay. So we'll be able to spin up a good batch of uh, fusion cells once once I hit the level to know how to do it. Am I getting close to that? What is that? Level 20? That's uh, miscellaneous. Level 20. Yeah. So I'm a ways off. I'm currently level, almost level 16. And I have not died yet. Nice. I haven't really fought much other than sitting in a pilot seat <laughs> using a big gun. So, yeah. Okay. Let's get to building this thing. Get our starter going. And then we've got our blocks. So here I'm just going to put my coffee down. Um, what 
else are we going to need right away? Probably the cockpit. Okay. Oh, actually, what I do need is I have a. Oh, I have it on the core. Okay, yeah, because I'm going to pop the core and move it. I don't like having it at the bottom of my ship exposed like that. So let's get this placed. And what we're going to do is we're just going to expand out on this really quickly here. Um, so we're going to move this down. Let's probably go to about there, I would think. So let's, and then we want to come out another one at least there. So we'll go like that. And like this, come on. Like this. And then so let's you know what? Let's just widen this out. And then, so the cockpit, uh, okay, if the wall was right here, so let's put this here, let's, let's build a box, I'm going to build a box here, okay, this is just how I do my cockpits, it has nothing to do with uh, looks at all, in fact, they look horrible, but they are very functional and safe, and it's the only reason why I have not died yet, is because of this design that I'm going to be doing here. Okay. So, we've got this box here that... Wait, is it, uh, is that big enough? That's not big enough, is it? No, it's supposed to be one more. So let's get rid of these ones here. Extend that out. At least I think it is. Yeah. Doesn't matter. I can always fill it in later, or do whatever. Okay, so. There's our where it's all going to be. So let's, and then we're going to have the core on top of that block in behind the one that I just placed. Okay, so let's pop the core. And you never get a core back, you only get pieces. I'm not sure why, but whatever. And then I'm going to just replace that with a block for now. Come on. Okay. And we're going to put a core back in right now. And we're just going to put it right there. Okay. So. Now I've got this area here. I think I want a exposed cockpit. Let's get the drone going now. And bring the cockpit in. Um, oh, there it is. It's in my toolbar. Derp a derp. So what do we want? We want the open one, the white one, or the dark one. That one looks more comfortable. Let's see this one. Yeah. It is quite large, isn't it? Okay. So, let's build the walls up around this, for starters. I can always knock blocks out later, right? So, not a big deal. Oh, 
Hello? No, that's not what I wanted. Let's get rid of that. Or, hmm. No, actually, I need all that space when I'm inside. I need it all. Okay. And then... Ooh, wait. If I get stuck in behind there, so that's okay. I'll just put the, I'll put stuff in behind there. Yeah. Okay. Sorry, I'm muttering in myself. It's just if, if, if I um, put my my grade on that I liked my shutter door or whatever you want to call it. Um, and I'm in behind the seat, I will be stuck. If I get ejected in behind the seat, I, I can get stuck. So, I either make it so that I can't go in behind the seat, or always leave the side block blocks there open. Well, I'm going to need to put a ventilator in there. So let's start with a ventilator. And we'll just put that there for now. Now I won't now I won't be able to be ejected in behind the seat cuz there won't be enough overhead height. You'll see here as soon as I finish this. No. Come on. Ugh. What is it doing? Wow. Really? <laughs> that was trippy. Okay, let's try this again. And, okay. Cross. Yeah, I don't have windshields anymore. It's just, it's just stupid. <laughs> There's no point. I don't ever fly in first person. Okay. Um, now, is that it? Is that my... That looks like it. Yep. Okay. So, now we need the... We need this. The shutter doors. And... So those are going to be the 4x3, and we pivot them, and 1, 2, and that goes in, right, come on, and in. Are you going to go down? No? Why not? Come on. Is there a problem? What's the problem? What's the problem? That's a four by three. So what's the problem? Oh, it's not tall enough because the seat is blocking it. Okay. Okay. So I must have my hover one higher then. Yeah. Okay. So, well, let's do it then. you and one more side okay so now we'll be able to put that in and it likes to go in from this side okay okay so there is our box with a with a flat deck isn't it beautiful huh huh not really, no. Um, we can put some stuff inside there, actually. I think we should do the O2 station and a fridge. Yeah, or two. So let's do... Come on. 
that there and go that there. I could put another one. Sure, why not? Okay. I'm always inside the, the cockpit for the most part, so that makes the most sense. That's good enough. I can access it from control panel anyway. Okay, so now we need to put stuff in. Let's, for starters, we're going to need more blocks, aren't we? So that's just not even close to enough. So I know it's probably going to have to come out at least that far. This thing's going to be ugly, ugly, ugly. Okay, so we've got these jets. Because I had enough cobalt from smashing all the rocks. <clears throat> so my plan is to have four in every direction. So we've got upwards facing... Um, so I was thinking something like um, so we want okay so if I put it right in the middle I can put blocks under so so we'll do two upward facing that side and then Okay, so there's the upward facing ones. Now we want the downward facing. So we're gonna spin this. And so we're gonna want one probably right up front here, although that's where the front hmm. Hmm. I'm just trying to f think if there's a balance, a need to balance this out. I've never really tried balancing all the thrusters. Let's put one there. And there. Okay, so that's two down. Because uh, I'm going to have to put another down one, I think. Let's just do it right beside it. Yeah, that works. That's fine. That's fine. So, okay. And then, well, with all the gear going in the back, that might be fairly in the middle. Okay, and then we want two facing frontward on each side. So let's pivot this. So, and we'll have, we'll do it there. And there and then this one will go there and there and then okay so now it's just the rear facing thrusters um, so I'll put those in later they're gonna come later I gotta put some more stuff in here. So that's the that's the front, bottom. Okay, so up, down, and front. So we can go backwards. So now we still gotta go side to side and back. So the side to side ones. Hmm, that's interesting. Let's. I kind of want a little bit more protection for that there. I think we'll do the side to side. Uh, yeah, let's try. Here, let's flip that. And then we could do. In one, two, 
three and well, we could do just four right there and like that. Is awful weird. This is going to be such a bizarro build. Let's do it. I, I don't know. I have I have no vision for this thing. <laughs> okay. Okay. All I know is that's a hell of a lot of jets on it so far. Jets on a box. Okay. Uh, so we just need the rear ones, which we'll do later. Uh, yeah, we'll do those later. Let's get some generators and fuel tanks and RCSs and stuff like that in. Uh, so we've got fuel tanks here. Okay. So I'm thinking I need, I'm going to need like. all three generators so let's do one two three um, so gas tanks let's stand those up to one two three uh, we can do, we can lay this one down, come on, right there, and then we can put, we're going to fit the warp drive, with the warp drive tank, the armor locker, all these RCSs, so the mobile constructor, the RCSs, we need some cargo box too, so, okay, so let's, Put that there. Yikes. Okay, so let's spin this. Uh, let's take a look at the size of this 325. God. Okay, so ugh, it's ridiculous, isn't it? Um, so I need to pop that fuel tank out stand it up yeah okay so we're gonna stand that up or should I should I just put one RCS in and no because we're gonna have I'm going to have some something going over top of that. Okay, so, and then we want, well, we can put a bunch of RCSs right there. Or what's this? One, two, two. So it's a two. That's two, four, five. These are singles. So, um, Okay, let's do this. And okay, that's gonna stick out past a couple blocks, but we've still got more stuff to put on, so let's Oh, I could lay it down across. Huh. That's an interesting notion. Um, let's, let's actually get some bigger cargo boxes here. I need to put the O2 in. Hey, come on. Come on. So I want to spin you. Like, no, one more, thank you. And right there. Um, 
So we can put that one there too. Okay, let's get this O2. Where's my O2? Get three of those. So we'll do one, two. Hmm. That's that scared the crap out of me. My own guns just scared the crap out of me. turret. Okay, so what do we need? We hmm. not really a huge fan of having huh Let's see. And then we can just put more. What do we got? Oh yeah, my, um, we got this and ammo and this. Oh, so we've got to put these two things in. Okay, so this will slide in there, and this, oh, I don't know, it's going to be buried. Okay, and then, and then... Put the ammo cargo boxes so we need more steel blocks so let's get some making because we're gonna need a bunch on the advanced constructor that I looted from that POI and so most of my good stuff I have on my base now is all looted I kind of like that that's cool um, Making blocks. Here we go. We only can afford the steel ones right now. So we'll make a hundred at least, I'm thinking. six of these, five, six, and we want four of these, one, two, three, four, <clears throat> can't forget the guns, okay, so let's get these blocks in, let's try and figure out some shapes and stuff, right now it's just a big block, it's really pathetic, All we have to do is put thrusters, the rear front thrusters on and it would fly, but... Hmm. We gotta get those rear thrusters in. So I'm thinking on the sides here. See that? Because I've already got these ones sticking out, so I'm gonna have metal... This is gonna get all, like, just a big blob. I think I'm just gonna have a metal blob flying. So let's go for the blob. And put these in. So let's, okay, we'll just put that over there for now. So I'm thinking, we'll flip that, come on. Oh, wrong way. Okay, so we want, we want one, two, three, and come on, four, okay, hmm, 
So now we just need to, to contour it with some blocks and, and cover up its parts. Let's see how it flies right now. Let's see how it flies. So do I got, uh, what do I got on me? I got fuel and oxygen. I need to eat something really quick here. Um, let's see if the garden's ready. And almost, almost ready. So we can get some, we can get a couple cans of food made, I think. So we'll get this, um, yeah, level 16 by picking flowers. I love leveling and being able to create better electronics and spaceships by picking flowers. That is, it's, it's a pretty mighty universe when being a botanist also makes you a rocket science scientist. Not to say you can't be one and both, I'm just saying, um, yeah, forget it. Okay, get all this, and nice, and excellent, and I think we'll have enough pears now to make some pie, yeah, we're gonna make us some pie, oh, that, get some money, and yeah, the corn's not ready. <clears throat> okay, so this one up here is going to be my canner, so this one's going to get the, those, um, and I will, let's see, so, Hmm. It's making its stuff. Um, do I have any points in there? No. Let's just cancel that for now, because I want to make some... St oh, I, actually, I'll just steal these. Keep those going again. There we go. <laughs> okay. Uh, we need water. So let's put that in there. Uh, water, we'll grab it out of this one, so we'll grab like half of it. And then we'll go into this food processor. Put that in there, get, get some cans going here. Nice. We're making our own veg canned vegetables, look at this. I'll just eat it right now. Actually, I should be eating the... I should make pie. That's what I'll do. Okay, so let's put this. In there for now. And we'll make some, oh, this is supposed to be good stuff. I'm supposed to make a whole ton of this. So let's just go crazy with this for now. And okay, good enough for now. Let's put that in there. And then we're going to put the ammo. Okay, so let's just grab something to eat out of the fridge. Is this one? Nope. I got to label these. I really got to label these. Is this one? Yes. So we'll grab some of that and hell, a hamburger. There we go. Okay. And oh, this one's ready to pick. Okay. And those pumpkins are ready now. Jeez. Okay, so we'll do the pumpkins then. So that means the durians will be ready pretty quick too here. Here also, so we'll just... No, maybe not. Maybe not. Okay, pumpkins take forever to spoil, so I'll just throw them in here for right now. Uh, we're going to have to come up here and check on the durians pretty quick though, because I don't want the tomatoes spoiling. Okay. So, where are we at here? Let's get these weapons. Looks like it's almost done the last one here. We'll just wait for it for a second. We've got the landing gear. We've got the ammo box. Okay, so weapons. 
and then more steel blocks we can put some more cargo in too good 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 okay so we've got those now and I do make, need to make some more steel plates for the canner so let's get off that and make steel plates and we'll just make a hundred for now okay. so get back to the SV so now that I've had something to eat <laughs> Okay, um, let's just give it a shot. And we're going to go in here. We're going to check it. Actually, it won't say it's... The, oh, it does. Okay, so 68 meters per second. Whoa, am I reading that right? No. That's going to slow down a lot when I put blocks on it. And then, especially when I upgrade the blocks to hardened steel, that'll slow down a lot too. Okay, well, let's give this... Let's just see what it's like anyway. Um, oh, I guess I gotta put fuel in it. <clears throat> and why not? We'll oxygenate it. Um, I don't have any pentaxid, so whatever. Go like this. And feels pretty responsive. It's like super duper fast. I can like fly super fast backwards. Yeah. See, that's what I want. I can like almost crash and stop and just fly backwards. <laughs> okay. So I get to 39.5 and just like almost instantly really fast each direction. This is going to work well for strafing. Yeah. This flies really well. It's not too, too twitchy, so... Nice. Okay. Well, we know it flies. I now have a flying SV. All I gotta do is put some skin on it. So, I'll do that off camera. I think um, we'll call this an episode. Um, I got my my SV flying with all the gear in it, including the warp drive and everything. So really, all, all I'm looking to do is put, you know, the uh, the weapons on now. The the um, the oof, the landing gear. <laughs> um, what else do I need? Uh, yeah, weapons landing gear and just put some more metal on it. There we go. My flying box and my hover box. So it'll it'll function pretty much the same way as my hover box with its how its uh, how its cockpit works. And yeah, I like it. I'm just gonna skin it up and weapon it up. And I'll put a bigger bulkhead on here and we'll take it up and explore with it next time. So if you like this episode, like and subscribe. The next episode, we're going to take my SV uh, up to the moon, maybe. Hmm? Time to go to the moon? I think it's time to go to the moon. Okay, guys, next time. Have a good one.